Oh my god, I am not funny! It's You're not Tuesday, funny! It's Tuesday, Harry! It's Tuesday! Yo, what is up guys? It's Taylor here, um, and this is my homeboy Tommy. Hola. Um, this is my first time having a guest star on here. <laughs> I am content starved, so I'm already being self-indulgent and looking at old shit of mine, even though I don't have that big a following yet. You've got a big enough following. You'll be, you'll be fine. Yeah, I, I, guess, I guess 50 subscribers is a lot of people. So we're going to be looking at a short film that we made back in high school a long time ago called It's About Time. Which we made for a... Originally, uh, me and Taylor wrote the script for a... Junior, junior Spectacular? Yeah. Junior Spectacular. So it was a series of one-act plays. One of a... Like, we'd write a one-act play, we entered into this competition. The script that got liked the most uh, would end up being made into a full production. And the, in, the, invariably, that was always the rich white kids. Yeah. And we're not bitter about that at all. Not at all. <laughs> Fuck North Central. <laughs> Fuck North Central. <laughs> Anyways, um, but thankfully um, we, we were in a film and animation class so we still got to take the script and make it into a film. And it, it, kind of, it ended up a little bit differently um, than how the play Significantly went. Significantly differently, in my opinion, for the better. True, true. Um, it's but, still bad, though. Yeah, it's still, it's still, still pretty bad. You can still, you can still tell it was made by a bunch of seventeen-year-olds. Uh, I actually have not watched it in a while, so this is gonna be interesting. Yeah. All right, so let's get it started. Listen closely. The watch will appear at exactly two or three p.m. in the hallway, baby. You must get it to me and bring it to me for the plan to work. If you don't, then someone else will. It's only a matter. We what? thought we were being so fucking cool with that intro. Yeah. Also, you can barely hear it. In yeah, the uh, our audio editing was shit. We were terrible at it. Oh, okay, but... Let's just, continue. Yeah, we got more. We got more. We got more. Alright, I assume everybody's turned their homework assignment into the uh, front table here. It's not a bad gag, but the build-up is super weird. Yeah, and it doesn't, it does it's kind of out of place. Like, well, there's a lot of times you'll see where we attempt comedy, and it just, it, it does not work, because, because we... Cause, we weren't funny! Yeah, 17-year-olds just do not have a grasp on comedy. I mean, in general. There's probably the some 17-year-olds that the most, I mean, there's some funny 17-year-olds, yeah, for sure. But, but it, it wasn't us. Wasn't us. Alright, last week we talked about how over-narration is, is plaguing amateur writing. This was and our attempt to be meta. We well, more specifically, about... his attempt to be meta. Yeah, I, I was obsessed with meta humor back then. And this week I thought we would talk about... Exposition. Exposition? What's that again? Oh god, <laughs> no, I cannot, I, I can't watch myself. John Travolta in this circle thing where you've got this really nice piece of hairlessness that is really okay. So we got poor nice Mr. Hyman to just go over here and add yeah, yeah, I feel, like I feel so bad. I feel so bad for Mr. Hyman. <laughs> There's Luke. Whatever oh, happened to him? Whatever happened to Luke? You know, I, th I think he might be dead, actually. There's a... Hello? I'm not dead, you asshole. Oh my god, Luke! We're still friends on Facebook. I like your posts all the time. Oh, really? Oh. Yeah, but if, I, if you genuinely cared about me, I guess you'd notice. I guess you haven't changed at all. Huh. Hmm. So, uh, do you think he subscribed? I mean, I, 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 I don't doubt it. I, I'm sure he did. I'm sure he did. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure he did. I'm sure. This is not an endorsement. 
fuck is going on? Fuck this guy. It's Friday, Friday. Get the fuck away from me. Okay, so like, okay, that, 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 that song, that song wasn't even relevant then. Like, I don't know why we included it, and I, I don't think, know why we fucking it, made the audio like ten times the. Was it our editor that decided that that would be a funny gag, or our, our director? It, yeah, I think so. I'm not. We're not gonna. We're not gonna throw him under the bus. Though. Okay. Yeah. We're not gonna throw Max Harp under the bus. Yeah, there's the bell. <laughs> Homestuck music. <laughs> oh my yeah, out there. Check out what I found just outside Mr. Thompson's class. Whoa! I've never seen an actual pop- Aren't you guys excited that it's Friday? Um, Harry? It's Tuesday. Oh my god, I am not funny! It's You're not Tuesday, funny! It's Tuesday, Harry! It's Tuesday! <laughs> anyway, um, I was trying way too hard to be comedic, really. This is awesome! It's like some sort of, uh, pocket watch time machine. Time machine. Oh my god. Okay, so he's well I was trying I was trying to reference hot tub time machine there, which And he I thought he was being so I I yeah, I thought it was clever, but I guess I for some reason I didn't realize that like nobody has seen Hot Tub Time Machine. Or maybe, at the like, time or now. Yeah. The trash can's probably gonna break under the weight of my fat ass. <laughs> ah, it's fine. <laughs> Think about what we could do with this. Yeah. We could change the past. We could stop the Titanic from sinking or save President Lincoln. Yeah. We should sell it on eBay. What? He didn't even he didn't even get my head. I think I, I think I pussied out of getting hit. I think that's what that was. Hello and welcome to your brand new pocket watch time machine. It's welcome to and that's our director, Max Hart. Yeah, that's Max. And we are definitely throwing him under the bus. <laughs> We're only doing that because he's probably going to be miles more successful than we ever will. <laughs> Think about that effect right there. That took for fucking ever to render. I remember that. Like we had, there well, we was had some to, shitty fucking computers. Yeah, true. But it was supposed to come back. It was we were supposed to have that come back at the end, which I'll talk about later. But like we we had to cut it because it we it took forever just to render this little bit right here. The first thing you should definitely know is that you can only go back and forward two days. But here are four things that you need to know about your brand new time machine. Rule number one, pressing the button will freeze time. Pressing the button twice will send you back in time. Pressing the button three times will send you forward in time. Pressing four times... Wait, 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 wait. So, if I killed my own grandfather, I would die. Yes, because I would kill you. Fair enough. I'm not 100% sure that I came up with that line, but I still have, it's still my script, so I still have to take the responsibility for it. We're going back to the future! I mean, two days ago! By the way, Teen Titans Go, you stole that joke from us, and I'm suing your ass for it. Then let's go back to the future! I mean, the past! I won't, yeah. I won't win, but... <laughs> not so! Crap! They got away! Uh, hey, boss. Uh, we might have missed them slightly, a little bit, sort of. Ah, uh, crap. Fine, just meet me and I'll see what we can do. Alright. Bye, sir. I don't know why he decided to kiss him there, but... I, th I think that was a reference to the the play because like, oh, yeah. yeah in the play version that, that he calls him mom or something like he's that. like he's like I love you too sir I yeah so I love you too sir like to that. Yeah. all right you practically illiterate children you guys get five minutes to be uh, to get your speeches together go ahead all right I don't want you to remember about the other two What was our debate about again? I, just, I, I completely, like, I, I, you could see that I, like, just completely forgot my line or something. Or I would just spaced out completely because I was just like, and I don't know why we didn't edit around that, but. I think we just, I think at that point we were just sort of just like, yeah, fuck it. Yeah, We're probably, gonna do whatever. Probably, that's, yeah. <laughs> Time travel is definitely possible. How else do you think that George Washington was the first man on the moon? Now ask yourselves that! Here's basically my formula for writing jokes for Harry. Just 
take three completely unrelated things and unrelated like pop related. culture things. Because yeah, he's a huge fan of pop culture things. Yeah, I you can you can tell I watched way too much Family Guy back then. Well, that was fun. Oh, there you are wearing a completely completely different shirt. Different shirt. I fucked up the continuity. How about we go? No, I was like so pissed about that, like. <laughs> Like, you I, were losing your fucking mind, and I was just like, chill, dude, it's just a shirt. I, I really thought, like, the continuity was gonna be a bigger deal. I didn't, I, like, nobody, nobody noticed. Literally, no, no one. No one. <laughs> uh, what are we gonna do next? Dude, enough is enough. Come on, look where we are. I, you know I don't, I, I don't want to move. I know you're moving, and that sucks, but you gotta face it. The, the meme moving plot, the Tim moving plot. Oh, yeah, was, that was. A big, much bigger deal, and that was supposed yeah. to be, like, the emotional through line. Um, yeah, and I, I, we just did not do a good job of making it clear that that's what like the actual that was story driving was. our character. Yeah, I, th I think we did. I think we kind of tacked it on at the last second. I don't yeah. Know. Oh, for Christ's sake, Harry, over here. He said, Christ's sake, I feel like that's kind of edgy oh, for a there student. You are. For, oh, for you a doing? high school student film, maybe. Wait, how do you know about the watch? Who are you? I am. Um... Savage. And I am Shonen. <clears throat> and there's Kronos. Hi. I call myself that. Wait. So that's your nickname. Then what's your real name? What do you mean your nickname? I, uh, we have never heard him say nickname. Yeah, well, no, there's a very quiet line there where he says, I call myself that. Like, we. Okay, you, you, you was, can barely hear audio you editing. can barely hear him say, "Oh, I'm Cronus." My real name is Harry. Uh, <laughs> you were supposed to be able to see my face there. That was supposed to be like a big reveal. And just we did we did not check the footage. At we all. were just we were just kind of going with it as we like we're, yeah. we gotta get so, this much footage in at this time. Yeah. So then when we went to edit this, we were like, "God damn it, we can't see my face," which is the whole point of. The, but we, we didn't have any time to go back and reshoot it. So it was terrible. To, but having future Harry be the villain also like directly contradicts the rules that we established for the time travel. Why are you kidding yourself? Why are you kidding yourself? I'm still proud of that joke. That was close. I, I got an idea. Let's beat up Harry. Yeah, well. Tommy made a funny edit of that. Let me just throw that in right here. I got an idea. Let's beat up Harry. Yeah, well. Oh, oh. oh <laughs> Jesus. So oh. we couldn't actually get Luke Skullsky to hit properly. Yeah, um, dude. Like, <laughs> I love you, Luke, if you're watching this, but you were just bad at fake hitting. So first he was actually hitting me. And <laughs> I think he actually like, left a bruise on my skin. I'm a weakling, so, okay? He probably wasn't hitting that hard. So, but then when he was fake hitting me, he, like, for some reason just couldn't get it at a realistic <laughs> angle. And I, I guess that was the best take we had, so that's what we went So through. fuck it. And then we got to me, which is almost worse. Yeah, I got this. How did you learn that? How did, they, how what did, did this how did those offense lead to? What the fuck? Uh, what happened with the script, no. man? So that was our short film, it's and not, it's terrible. It fucking unwatchable. You know what? Like, even though it is, it is shit. Like, I honestly didn't even think that we were, it was even gonna be shot because um. Because when we got into our groups, we each individually had scripts, so it was kind of like a vote thing. So yeah. I, I'm, I'm on it. I'm just, ha I'm happy it even got to be made. Really, I will say this: um, at the very least, for a student film made by a bunch of seventeen-year-olds who don't know what they're doing, at least it wasn't like a black and white, like "Oh, I'm so depressed" kind of movie. You yeah, know? true. It, it yeah. didn't deal with suicide or breakups or anything like that. It was ambitious. Yeah. With, Stupid, but ambitious. <laughs>
if you want to go watch, I'll put the link in the description. It's on his channel, um, so go subscribe to him while you're there and pressure him into making more videos because he hasn't done that in a while. Yeah, yeah, no, a absolutely. Just go ahead and comment on any of my videos, particularly the Kevin one. I'm actually very proud of that one. Well, subscribe to Tommy's channel. Subscribe to me. Give me suggestions for uh, other shit you want me to react to. If you want me to take a look at other old shit of mine, I got plenty of that. I've got I've got a whole old YouTube channel full of cringy videos. If you want me to take a look at that, they're absolutely um, terrible. Yeah, yeah. No offense. Um, <laughs> I mean, no offense to you, of course. No, 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 none taken. Don't forget to like, subscribe, all that jazz, and I will see you guys next time.